Hello, welcome to the channel today. Um, just a quick one. We're still on the Discovery Wimbledon Green um, Adventurer. Um, we was about to take the MLT, we've done absolutely everything. Um, but when we went talking for a test drive, the ABS keeps coming on on one of the wheels. Um, but there's no code showing on the code reader. So I was unsure what it was. So what we've done is we've got it up on the lift um, and we've put it into gear and we've put the computer on there and we're going to live stream the data since there's nothing um, showing as a fault we're going to live stream the data to see which one is um, not doing what it's supposed to be doing so I'll flip the camera around this is how you flip the camera around so we've plugged in the uh, whatever it's called iCarsoft LR2 and as you can see there we're in first gear all the wheels are spinning we've put a bit of acceleration down and the front right hand is sticking at 1.7 kilometers an hour so obviously that sensor a sending the readings that it should be sending to the car which is therefore putting the abs on for some reason um, so what we're going to do is we're going to change that sensor and hopefully then we can take the car for an mot because um, everything else is done and it's ready to go but that's what you need to do get the, get this out or something like this that you've got that'll take live data put it in through the abs and check the live data and then you can see which wheel's doing what obviously some are moving slower than others simply because it is generally two wheel drive um, it hasn't got a diff lock so we can't lock the diffs to send equal power to all wheels so you'll find that that one's doing three at the bottom ten at the top but no matter what we do no change from that front right hand so we'll change that and uh, hopefully that helps somebody check theirs out if you've got no actual fault on there but the ABS is coming on while you're driving Please like and subscribe, help us build the channel. See you later.